the adventures of the Assistant and Wiggles. Hey, you three. Thanks for helping me out there. No problem, Mr. Malone. That's what we're here for. Remind me again what it is we're doing. Mr. Engineer said we were going to help Austin's dad fix his car. That sounds less than thrilling. Isn't this exciting? We're using science to bring cars back from the dead. Okay, now you have my attention. Positive to positive and negative to negative. Ah, transference of electricity is a beautiful thing. But this is something that only adults should do, okay? Why? Yeah. Oh, that's why. Maybe it wasn't the best day to wear my new spring shoes. Mm, yeah, let's try this again. Hey, hey, you did it! That's so cool. How did that work? Well, you see, Assistant, all Mr. Malone's battery needed was a little jump start from our own. So we hooked the batteries together and the electricity flowed from one to the other. Thanks so much, guys. I owe you one. Hope your dog isn't traumatized. Traumatized? Of course not. <laughs> Unable to ever take a bath again? Maybe. <laughs> but you sacrifice for science. You know, you two are so helpful today that I only think it's fair that you get to go to the new Rock and Roller theme park. Hooray! That's groovy. Crazy world we live in where you have to buy a dog a ticket to get into a theme park, but I ain't complaining. That's the alarm! Jumpin' Einstein! It looks as though the roller coaster is frozen while the carts are in a loop! Oh no! That's my friend Molly! Assistant, can you quickly race to the scene and save the day? Absolutely! It will be my honor! Wonderful! I'm gonna... <gasps> take a nap! Such a responsible adult! <laughs> now that I've trapped everyone on the roller coaster upside down, I can begin phase two of my plan. Whew, and let me just say, this is far and away the best artwork I've ever done. Now I just have to connect this battery to my vacuum. Success! Now I'll be able to steal their wallets and purses with ease. Oh man, I'm gonna buy so much cotton candy! It's Rowdy Raccoon! Ah, Wiggles and the assistant here to stop me. Just what are you up to, Rowdy? Well, as I was explaining to myself out loud just a moment ago, I shot off the electricity to the roller coaster so I could freeze everyone upside down and collect their various money holders. That's a really complex plan for such a simple solution. Yes! I I am a genius! Go on, it's okay to use that word. Genius. Not really what I had in mind. Well, let's say you try and stop me when you're stuck inside my vacuum. We've got an idea, right? And by we, I mean you! I think I might have something we could use in my backpack. What is this? It's a slime bump. I was gonna use it to prank Mr. Engineer. <laughs> well, now it's gonna be a bit busy saving our lives! What? What did you do? Uh, how did you? Uh, is it broken? Ah, it's dark and slimy. Where am I? Where am I? What? Well, who's distracted? We have to save everyone on the roller coaster. I can see my house from here. We really need to mow our lawn. Let's go check out the control panel. Ah, the motor is off. We're gonna have to move the roller coaster carts with our hands. What? We can't climb all the way up there. Maybe we don't have to. Almost got it. Just a little closer. Your dog is starting to get really annoying. I think we need to try something else, because this isn't working. Well, I am open to suggestions. <clears throat> Today is just not my day, huh? Hey, what's this? It looks like a really bad comic book. It's Rowdy. These must be his plans. It looks like he took the battery out from the roller coaster's control panel. He must have put it inside his vacuum. All we have to do is take it out, put it back into the control panel, and we can bring the roller coaster back to life. Well, good luck with that. Cause I'm back and ready for action, baby! And now, let's see you handle my vacuum at double the power! <laughs> it's too powerful! Hey, you guys gonna 
to help us or what? We're working on it. I've heard of spring cleaning, but this is just ridiculous. Wait, that's it. Spring cleaning. Wiggle, take off your springs and let the vacuum suck them up. Gotta be honest, not seeing where you're going with this, but you're the boss, so... What's going on? Well, I'm not gonna act like I'm embarrassed that I have good taste in undies. Ah! Ooh, I want to ride the vacuum after this. Now let's get that battery out of the vacuum and back into the roller coaster. All right, let's see if this works. Oh no, Rowdy's vacuum must have drained the battery's power. Hello, just a reminder that your best friend is up here. There we gonna find another battery. Does anyone want to loan me their car battery for a few minutes? I've got a car battery you can use. Thanks. All right, one battery from the car all the way at the end of the parking lot at your service. I think an adult should take it from here. I agree. Let's see, positive, negative, negative to positive. Wait for ah! ah! It's the other way around. That it does. Does make more sense. All right, try it out. Hey, you guys did it. Oy, what happened? <laughs> Well, the squeal and hurl definitely lives up to its name. Molly, are you okay? Give me a second to let all the blood rush back from my head. Then we can talk about it. I'd say today we kicked some butt and took some names. Am I going crazy or did an evil raccoon trap me upside down on a roller coaster? Oh, uh, well, crazier things have happened. If they have, I don't think I want to know. Want to go ride the hurl world Sure. Is every ride about throwing up? Yeah, it's a totally weird theme. Hey everybody, are you ready for a hair raising good time? That's right, Assistant. In our video, we learned all about electricity. Well, kind of, how to hook up a battery. Now we're gonna use a special Van der Graaff generator to learn more about it. So Assistant, turn on the generator and let's watch what happens. So she turns it on. Okay, people, do you see those sparks? Sit to put it a little closer. So what happens is the electricity jumps from the negative to the positive terminal. terminal. So the electrons are created inside the big ball, which is right there, and then they jump to the small one. Right? Yeah, isn't it cool? Because so, Assistant, what does that feel like, being next to that generator? Well, it's pulling up my hair. That's right. So, the Assistant is using the wand right now to discharge the electrons. Okay, so the Assistant is right now just standing on the ground. So, the electricity is going from the generator to a, what they call the ground. That's just like, elect like lightning. Right, Assistant? Yeah. Now, we're going to do something real fun. We're going to put the Assistant on this plastic because this plastic is an insulator. And then we're gonna let her hold it and let's see what happens, okay? Okay. All right, assistant, we're gonna step on the plastic. But here's the assistant. Okay, assistant, put your hand on the generator. Ready? <laughs> it isn't, it doesn't, right? Okay, now she's, she's standing on the plastic and she's not gonna touch the table at all, right? Right. All right, assistant, reach over and turn on the generator. Okay. All right, now shake your head out. Keep shaking it. People at home, what's happening to her hair? All right, this is it. Shake your hair out a little bit more. Go. Oh, use your hand and even fluff it. Keep going. Look, people at home, look at her hair. Look at the assistant's hair. <laughs> Keep going, assistant. Keep going. Keep going, assistant. Look at her hair. That's because she's on an insulator and the electricity can't get to the ground. So what it's doing is it's accumulated in her hair as static electricity. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Okay, assistant. Now take one foot and put it on the ground. Watch your hair, people. Ready? Take it off. So you're not stepping on the plastic at all? No. 
Okay, you see how our hair kind of went down a little bit? All right, I'll step back on it. And see, it lifted back up. Okay, now it's just gonna take both feet and, and step off. She's got rubber shoes on, so it won't all the way down. Now her hair went down a little bit. Now step back on, and up it goes. <laughs> so that's about electricity. It goes from negative to positive is how it actually flows. So okay, folks, you've learned about electricity. That's how the assistant was able to use electricity to get the roller coaster going. Yeah. And why, if you touch positive and negative, you might get a little bit of a shock, right? Right. Okay, everyone, have a great day. Bye. Bye. Hey there, everyone. Thanks for watching our video. Now make sure that you subscribe to the Engineering Family so you can see lots of cool videos. In fact, there's another cool video right there. You can select and watch it. I think you're really going to like it. Is it Team Umazumi, Paw Patrol, Surprise Eggs, Frozen, Blade, Masha? There are so many videos to watch. Bye!